only all-metal turbojet hydroplane in the world, Donald Campbell's 25,000-pound Bluebird is in fighting trim, all set to smash the world water speed record of over 178 miles an hour, reached by American Stanley Sayer three years ago. Two men have died trying to break it, but Donald Campbell believes Bluebird has the answer. Hundreds are here to watch. These aren't things from outer space, they're marker boys. Bluebird is named after the racing cars and speedboats in which Donald's father, Sir Malcolm Campbell, set up his pre-war records. Weighing two and a half tons, she is held together by 70,000 rivets. Her Metropolitan Vickers Beryl turbojet engine has a 4,000 horsepower thrust. And there she goes, streaking across Owl's water at three miles a minute. At such a speed, the smallest ripples hammer the hull like broken concrete. The slightest mistake can mean disaster. A submerged log can mean death. But Bluebird is riding like the thoroughbred she is. A two-way run over the measured course is averaged out to give the correct speed. Bluebird goes about for the return run. A deadly danger about the 200 miles an hour mark is the so-called water barrier, when pressure sets up vibrations which can shatter the hull like an explosion. Both John Cobb and Maria Verga died that way, attacking the present record. Unofficially, Bluebird topped the record at 185 miles an hour. A good omen for the official test.